How'd you get in? Stole the key from my coach. What if we get caught? We're not doing anything wrong, and we're the only ones here. You ever teach anyone to swim before? Yes, enough questions. Dive in. Hey, you really are afraid of the water. Okay, we'll take it slow. See, it's not so bad. What is it that scares you so much? It's dumb, really. Tell me. When I was a kid, I was swimming in a pond. I got my foot tangled in some underwater plants. I couldn't get loose. The harder I tried, the worse it got. Almost drowned. Oh man, what happened? My brother saw me, cut me loose. But ever since I've had this feeling that there's something down there, waiting, because I cheated at once, and he wants a second chance at me. Zeke, I guarantee you, in a pool, there's nothing down there to get you. Try putting your hand in the water. See, that wasn't so bad. Now try. Clarice, Clarice! What happened? Was that about puppies? Nothing. Are you okay? Yeah, I think. Maybe we should go. No, I want to help you. Now relax, there's nothing down there. Yeah, I know. Just take a look, nothing's there. See anything? No. Okay, put your hand in again. Do you smell that? Yeah, what is it? I don't know, it smells like, like acid. You're right. It's not logical. What was that? What's happening? It's trying to dump us. Let's get out of here. There is something in the pool. We can't paddle. It'll grab us. It's okay. We'll stay right here. Someone will find us. Wait. That smell. That acid smell. Something like that.
Charlie, what was that? It's back. Or maybe it never left. What's back? I was the lifeguard when this pool first opened. My girlfriend's little brother drowned on my watch, but it was no accident. I tried to save him, but it wouldn't let me. It pulled him away from me, and then, then he was gone. Nobody believed me until three more people drowned. They closed down the pool. People forgot all about it. Until now. What is it? What's in there? When they built the pool. They had to get rid of an old cemetery and move the bodies. The nearest I can figure is they missed one. And its spirit wants revenge for being disturbed. The same thing's going to happen. No one's going to believe us until someone gets hurt. Maybe not. Maybe there's a way to even things out a little bit. Nobody believes in this thing because it's invisible. But maybe we can get a look at it. How? It smells, remember? Like rotten eggs. Like acid. Here, methyl orange. We're gonna do a little experiment. Methyl orange reacts with acid. If this thing really is part acid, we should get a nice red snapshot. How can you be sure to... Wait. You smell that? That's it. It's coming. Look. What is it? I can't tell. Wait. It's taking shape. It looks like... It's... Moisture on your hands, it'll burn you. You need gloves. I'm going after it.
You did it. <laughs> you really did it. Finally. After all these years. It's over. Thank you, kids. Thank you. The evil spirit never bothered anyone again. And Charlie was no longer tortured by his memories. As for Zeke and Clarice, Clarice figured it was okay to be a science geek. And she showed Zeke there were a lot more fun things to do than study all the time. You want to go for a swim? Sure. Though Zeke still didn't care much for water. The end. Tell me that wasn't the best. Okay. We gotta vote. Um, you told a great story, but the vote has to be unanimous, and <laughs> it wasn't. But it's not fair. Yeah, well. Thanks for the shot. Wait! We're giving you another chance. Come to a couple of meetings and tell another story. If by then if we change... If we don't think you're a total puke. Then you're in. Fair enough? I can handle that. <sighs> then handle a shower.